Assalamualaikum guys. I'm going to teach you how to find your gonion in for your calf tracing. So, and you see a calf uh, radiograph. Sometimes you will see two mandibles. So, how are you going to do gonion in two mandibles? You have to trace both mandibles. Okay. After tracing it, you have to do these two lines for each of the mandible. The first one is you have to draw a line tangent to the posterior border of the ramus. And then the other line is tangent to the inferior border of the mandible. So that will create an angle. So bisect that angle and extend the bisecting line to the angle of mandible. Where the line meets the angle of mandible, that will be your gonion. But that that's will be your gonion number one because you have two mandibles, right? So for second mandible, you have to repeat the same process again for the other mandible in order for you to get the second gonion. Now you have two gonions. So, what is your real gonion that you will use? Is by connect the two gonions and then find the midpoint of it. So, the midpoint of the, the line is your real gonion. That is the gonion that you will use for your cephalometric tracing and to do your mandibular plane. Mm -hmm.